Okay, so in the previous lesson, I've explained how Fawn Awesome works and how to use uh, Fawn Awesome to on your website. Now let's move on to creating uh, lists with Fawn Awesome. All right. So with the default Bootstrap, whenever you create a list, whether it's an ordered list or unordered list, you you cannot apply an icon to every single. Uh, list item, but with Font Awesome you can, and that's one of the other advantages of using Font Awesome. So let's get started. Go to your project files, and you can see an example of what I'm going to create here under list icons. So if you're in a hurry, you can just swipe this, just copy the entire thing, change out the links, and change the icons. But since we're trying to learn anyway, let's start with the blank file. Gonna open the blank file and I'm going to save this blank file as list all right save it I'm going to make the fonts bigger and I'm going to create a split preview window over here all right so now we're not going to put in any of the grid classes because we're just going to focus on creating the ordered list Right. First of all, I'm going to remove the paragraph paragraph uh, class text center over here. I'm going to make it the font a bit bigger. So I'm going to put the bootstrap class of paragraph lead. All right. And now I'm going to delete the font, or maybe I'll just add it right at the bottom here. So let me create the basic list unordered list ul let's close the ul over here now let's add a list item okay and let's close that list item let's create a few list item okay so this is the basic list that you can create and as you can see it looks kind of boring so let's add font awesome to it the first thing you need to do for your unordered list, you need to declare the class of FA-UL, okay? All right, now you can see it looks a bit different here. The dots have disappeared. And now let's create uh, the icons on the individual list as well. So here's how you do it. Just use the default I class i class f a f a check all right and let's close that okay and now let's copy that to the other list items all right so you can see the list items here now appear with a checklist. So it's, it looks like a checklist and that's great. However, there's one other class you need to add. Okay, just after FA, let's add FA.LI. All right, and that actually positions the list or the icon much more accurately within the list. So this looks fine, but what happens is when um, you have a text that is too long okay when you have a text that is too long it will wrap underneath the icon and that's not what you want to happen you want the text to start at a slight indent away from the icon so by adding fali that is the correct class for each list item okay so you can add fali to all the other list items and there you go, you have your basic, beautiful list item with Font Awesome. And any other class of Font Awesome, you can also just easily apply it to the list item. So you can make the fonts uh, bigger. Well, in this case, it's hidden. And let's apply that to every single list item. Okay, which is not probably a good idea since it doesn't really appear very well. But you can also style it with different text classes All right that makes it blue 
here let me put text uh, danger and I'm going to change this to times okay so this is a example of maybe some of uh, a list of features or benefits maybe you want to compare your product to a competitor's product and this is a much better way to to do it all right so that's uh, that's all for this lesson where I have uh, explained how to create a very beautiful uh, unordered list using font awesome to get uh, to, to be able to put in any font or, or any icon that you want to each list item over here and make it really pop, make it really stand out.